So we're in the key of C, and we're gonna drop this E, the middle note, down to here. And remember, drop it down, and this is how you're gonna add mystery, watch this. C sharp, up, E flat down, F up, F sharp, down, A flat up, B flat down, C up, and remember we're gonna reverse this. So as a bonus, what we can do is, we can do this. So we're gonna start this off in the key of C. And this is so simple. You all know that my number one goal is to simplify your musical journey. So with this C chord, <laughs> we can take this up a half step to C sharp. And if you look at this in the key of C, the next door, the key that's up a half step is C sharp. So technically we're gonna be in the key of C sharp. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, A or one, but we're keeping the C at the bottom. <laughs> so technically this, if you start on the seventh scale degree, this is called the Locrian scale or the Locrian mode. So, because here's one, two, three, four, five, six, seven, one. Start on the seventh scale degree. So we're gonna go seven, one, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And then you go backwards. So that's called the Locrian scale or the Locrian mode. Starting on the seventh scale degree, up to seven, back down. So with that being said and done, what we can do is on this next level, we're gonna take this up. So we have a C, C sharp, E flat, F, F sharp, A flat, B flat, and C. Now this is where the magic comes into play. So what we're gonna do is, we have our C chord, we're gonna drop this E down here. This is kinda like a drop two chord. Y'all know my add two, drop two, where we do this. But technically this is like an open voicing. So we're gonna drop this E down here. And then these same notes, the C, G, and E, we're gonna move this down here. See this? And this is the pattern. So if we start here and we drop it down, that's our pattern. What's the next key up? C sharp. So what we can do is just move this up right here because C sharp is gonna go up. <laughs> now real quick, before we go to this next section, I would love for you guys to give this video a thumbs up. That keeps me encouraged. Only takes a couple of seconds to click that thumbs up button. And also, if you wanna have a little conversation below, if you wanna say, what's up, KC, or if you have a question, leave that question below. So with that being said and done, let's keep this moving. So let's review. C sharp up. Now what's after C sharp? You remember the low and scale. E flat. So we're gonna do the E flat major chord. Remember, drop this down. All right, so let's review. C down, C sharp up. E flat down, F up. <laughs> and I have a rootless chord video where I break all this stuff down. You guys have seen this. I, I promise I go through and show you how to do these chords quickly. All right, so let's review. So C down, C sharp up, E flat down, F up. F sharp, down, A flat up, B flat down, and then C up. And you know we can move this down, all right? Now, for those of you who feel like I'm moving too fast, feel free to download the PDF because I'm gonna do this in all 12 keys. I'm gonna give you the PDF so that way you can do this in our free club. And you all know it's a donation. Um, and with your donation, you get upgrades, uh, with MIDI files, PDF study guides, and some of them even have play alone tracks. So let's go down. So we did this, let's move this down. So we're in C, so we started up to the C. Now let's go backwards, B flat down, A flat up, F sharp down, F up, E flat down, C sharp up, F 
then C. And again, you can do this in all 12 keys. So as a bonus, what we can do is, we can do this. Now, the cool thing about this is, I break down this movement in this video right here. It's absolutely free here on our YouTube channel, but you all know that I never like to close any video without letting you know that today is a new day, a new life, and a new opportunity for you to become a better you. I love you guys so much. I'll see you in this video breakdown right here.